Sure. Well, I mean, anytime you win two out of three, it's it's a positive weekend, you know. Getting a start off on the right foot here in conference play. Um, you know, I think the the manner that it happened certainly was, uh, um, you know, I think good to see in a sense. You know, we had a really tough day on Friday, um, and it's never easy to go through a day like that. You, you know, losing, giving up 20 runs. You know, playing bad in pretty much every phase of the game. But uh, it was really good to see how our guys bounce back on on Saturday and, and over the course of the rest of the weekend and be able to take that series. You know, if you had told us we were going to win two out of three after that performance Friday, I think, you know, you would have surprised a lot of guys. So I think it says a lot about, um, you know, our guys and, and how they just kind of continue to show up to play and, and don't let a lot of things bother them. And, you know, in, in all honesty, um, you know, um, when you go from game to game in baseball and the whole momentum thing, it's really just about the starting pitcher the next day. And, uh, you know, we obviously were able to roll Farrell out there on Saturday and pitch a great game and got us right back in the series. And Ingram followed it up the next day and we were able to get out of there winning two out of three. So, you know, it sets us up in good position here moving forward, you know, with our games this week and moving into, you know, the kind of uh, heart of the conference play. So, uh, you know, overall, certainly a good weekend. Yeah, I mean, the Huskers will be a good test. I think they're, they're a team that continues to to get better and better, you know, year in and year out. I think they've done a good job assembling a good core of young guys, uh, particularly that lineup that they've put together, you know, with, with guys like Fonseca and, and, you know, Foster, Vossler, some of those young hitters have, have complemented well with some, you know, they still got some of the, those, those older guys around with, with Barbosa and Putras and Lyons and some of those guys. And uh, I think the lineups really come together pretty good. Well, you got to pitch well against those guys that, you know, you got to make good pitches and, and, uh, pitch for nine innings against them, or they can really be dangerous offensively. You know, um, you know. I, I think that from our standpoint, uh, it's a place. You know, when you go up there, it's it's typically a good place to pitch. You know, uh, they've had some good arms over the course of the year. You know, it's a bigger park. Uh, you know, playing on the turf and things. Uh, and I think, uh, you know, for the most part ball stays in the yard up there and you're going to be able to attack the strike zone and, and force those guys to beat you and, and hopefully if we can do that we're going to be all right but you know it'll be a fun fun weekend you know certainly I think you know for myself I had a chance to coach a lot of those guys uh, a couple years ago when I was up there you know those juniors and seniors and um, you know I know the guys in the coaching staff well a couple of former players of mine up there so that'll be fun to get back there but I know that they're uh, you know they do a good job with their guys certainly and, and I know that they're going to be a good test for us you know when we go up there you know right now they've had a couple conference weekends to this point and they've lost a couple tight games late that uh, probably could have gone either way or their record in conference would look much better but you know overall they're up over the 500 mark and playing pretty good baseball at this time of year so you know we'll have to go up there and play good to beat them and it you know be a good test coming off last weekend to see if we can continue to build that thing and continue to move forward in the right direction for us.